Hey YouTube, it's Annabelle. So it's late. I just got done working out about a half hour ago. Um, and my hair's mess and everything, but whatever. It's okay. I wanted to do a couple vlogs tonight. Um, just stuff that I've been thinking about um, since my daughter's birthday is coming up this week. Um, I've been thinking about all the stuff that's happened this last year and all the stuff that we've learned. And I've done a couple vlogs today about some of that stuff. And I just wanted to continue tonight um, with um, some products that we've loved, or products or things, whatever, that we've loved and ones that we ha thought were useless. Okay, so first of all, the products that we absolutely loved are um, her bouncy seat. And she used that from day one. Um, and she used it until um, she was, let's see, eight, eight months old, nine months old. I think it was nine months old. Um, we use that every day, every day. And um, when she was little, um, we had her, when she was like just born, we'd have her sleep in it because she was um, at an incline and we would just put it in, in the pack and play. Um, so that way she could sleep in it and she'd be in an incline. She slept a whole lot better that way. Um, we absolutely love that thing. Oh my goodness. It is one of the best inventions ever is that bouncy seat. Um, Another thing that we absolutely loved is our Fisher Price um, Rainforest Soother. That thing is a complete dream. Oh my gosh, I love it. Uh, I love the characters on it. I love the lights and the sound. And I shouldn't say I love it. My daughter loves it. Um, that was a definite, definite must for us. Um, I do not know where we would be if we didn't have that every night. Um but and when we go to travel we have found that we have to bring that with us we have to take it off for crib and bring it with us because she just doesn't know what to do without it either um so that was another thing that was absolutely amazing um another thing is pack and plays oh my gosh we love our pack and plays um it's not like the crib where it's a stationary um item like pack and plays you can roll them around you can take them down you can they pack away really easily you can travel with them um you can take them to friends houses you can move them into different rooms in your house um another invention that is just completely awesome we love our pack and plays we have two of them um another um uh, product that or item whatever you want to call it that we love um our fleece blankets um my daughter does not like rough fabrics so fleece blankets have been absolutely amazing, and they're very warm for the winter. Um, another item that we love is our Fisher Price high chair. Oh my goodness, it has um, seven different settings up and down. It has a recline in it. Um, it has the center post that goes in between their legs. Um, it has the adjustable tray. It's got the dishwasher safe top tray. Um, I we love the high chair. Absolutely love it. Um, another thing that we absolutely love are our Fuzzy Buns Cloth Diapers. Oh my goodness, they are amazing. Um, I had originally planned on um, doing mostly Fuzzy Buns and then getting a few here and a few there of other brands, but that's not going to happen. I love my Fuzzy Buns. Oh my goodness, I love them. Um, and if I had to do it all over again, I would do the same thing. Um... Another baby product that I absolutely love is the Medela pump and the bottles and just all Medela stuff. Um, I don't like their um, breast milk bags, though. That's the only thing from Medela that I have not liked that I've tried. Um, I do like the Gerber Nook breast milk storage bags. Those are my favorite breast milk storage bags. And let's see, um, we love our car seats. We had a Baby Trend car seat travel system. Um that it had a stroller with a jogging stroller. Um, I did some videos on some stroller exercise stuff that I was doing this summer. Um, it worked out perfect. Oh my gosh. Um, loved our baby trend car seat. Now we have a Graco Nautilus, I think it's what, it, what it's called. It's a three-in-one car seat. Um, so it'll grow up with her. And we got the, it's a gray, black, and red car seat. Oh my gosh, we love it. We have two of them. One is in my car and one of them is in my husband's truck. 
Um, that way we don't have to move car seats. And, um, let's see. Okay, so the items that, okay, so the items I just listed off were my absolute favorite items. Like, absolute favorite. Um, the next list are the items that were, like, toy items that my daughter absolutely loved. Um, she loved anything that was crinkly, and she loves bright colors, and her favorite, her favorite, um, like, thing was her exorcisor when she was younger and would bounce and bounce and bounce in it, and now that she has outgrown that, her favorite toy is her, uh, stand-up walker, because she plays with the toys in front, she walks with it, she runs around with it now, because she's getting more confident, but those were her favorite things, and she also likes um, the Fisher-Price Rainforest Floor Gym, um, it's, I've, like, she liked it more as she got older, um, and let's see, the Leapfrog Learning Table, I'm not sure exactly what the name of it is, but she loves that thing as well. Um, and she likes balls and cars right now. But those were her favorite things as she this last year as she was growing up. Okay, the things that we thought were absolutely useless um, that are like promoted items, I guess you would say. Um, baby bottles. There are a lot of like brand brand name ones out there. Um, that were, my daughter didn't like. And I know every baby is different. You have to find the right bottle for your baby. And for our family, well, for our daughter, the MAM, M-A-M bottles were her favorite. And she never took a pacifier or anything like that. So, um, just bottles, like, I was, like, we went through how many different kinds of bottles. And I just, that was the first thing that I was like, oh my gosh, ugh. It was just absolutely infuriating. But we found bottles at work, and we were sticking with them. Um, well, actually, she's on sippy cups now. So um, we'll see if um, our next child likes the ma'am bottles. Um, let's see. Receiving blankets. I think they're absolutely useless. I, like, have no use for them. Like, I just seriously, like, want to pitch all of them. They're too small to swaddle in. And we use the thermal blankets because um, they're stretchy, and you can actually swaddle um, the baby with them, and if we have a summer baby next, um, we'll probably get the, I think it's muslin cotton or something like that, but they're supposed to be breathable, and you're supposed to be able to use them in the summer, so your baby doesn't overheat, but receiving blankets, I just think they're useless, like, absolutely useless, never, never, ever, ever would buy any of them, um, I'm actually, like, I would put them on a changing table and let them be, um, like, soak up cloths for, like, if there was accidents. That's what mine ended up being used for. Um, oops, there we go. Um, wipe warmers. Like, seriously? First of all, if you leave the wipes in there, they dry up. And, but I'm not saying this from personal experience. I'm saying this from a friend's experience, and therefore I did not get them. Um, get one. But wipe warmers, apparently, like, if the wipes stay in there, they dry out, and, like, once you take them out, as soon as they hit the air, they're cold again. So they have to go directly from warmer to butt if you want them to be warm. Um, but, yeah, another useless item that we didn't even think about getting. Um, another thing, a lot of baby carriers are, in my mind, like, not that good um, for... Um, like infant, infant, like newborn, um, the Moby Wrap was our choice, and um, we actually have not gotten another baby carrier yet um, because um, the ones that we have tried have not been um, worth it to us or something that we would use or anything. So if we ever find one that would actually work for us, um, we would probably get it, but so far we were out of luck on finding a baby carrier to it carrier that, um, we actually like. Um, let's see. But yes, um, and I, I know I said this in tons of videos before, but you do not have to buy everything baby when you have a baby. It's a pick and choose what you think you'll need, um, 
like products that we love are things that we use a lot. And if you're not going to use it every day and if it's not going to be something that um, you're going to like or your baby's going to like, there's no use in having it. It's just taking up space. Um, but yes, anyways, so those are some of the baby products that we loved and some of the baby products that I believe are useless or they're at least useless for our family. And that's all I can think of right now. Um, but if I think of any more or if we have any more to add down the road, um, I will sure to let you know. Um, leave comments. Let me know what your favorite baby products are or if you disagree with me on the ones that I think are useless. If you have found them completely amazing, um, feel free to leave a comment and let me know how they worked for your family. Um, but yeah, if I think of anything else, I will leave it below. Otherwise, you guys have a wonderful evening. Bye, guys.